Hey guys, what's going on? Talonflame HD here, and welcome back to Star Trek Elite Force 2. Lead leading off from the last episode, we boarded the USS Dallas and restored power to the gravity systems and life support. We also opened those doors to allow the team to come through. So now, we are on deck 3, apparently, and our new objective is to restore power in engineering. So let's go do that now. Thanks, Frank. Thanks, Jill. Yo, Chell is spazzing. Right, life support at 50%. Wonderful. If life support's still online, then why are we still wearing our helmets? Hey, what's that? That is nothing pulling a dead body into nothingness. Yo, no, please, no, 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 no. Right, lounge. What's in here? Another dead body. Check your tricorder. Look at all those blips. But what are they? The blips are headed this way. They're getting closer. They're almost here. They're. Hey, you sound disappointed. The only thing worse than an alien attack is an alien attack that hides when you see it coming. And they just hit that door, Chell. Like, you're not going to make a witty comment about that. Structured integrity view mode shows that the door is able to break. So let's break it. This way, then. We've reached main engineering. Locked. We have to find a way in. These Jeffries tubes lead to an observation lounge near engineering. Good enough for me. Stay here. Yeah, I'm all. I'm always telling the team to stay. Like, shouldn't we send like the Excelsior expert, or you know, the field technician? What was that sound? Hello? Alien peoples? Are you here? Yo, what the... There's actually, like, nothing there. Like, that's the annoying thing. Lounge. Yo, I'm hearing things, and it's not nice. Like, I'm slowly starting to get concerned. I am partially concerned. Get away from us. Okay. Right, doors open. Got blips again. Moving in fast. Monroe, we're trapped. Get us in there. Use your tricorder on the main engineering console. Here's another one. Oh, I've got to do both. Ah, cut that off. Ah, blah, blah, blah. I'm sorry, guys. Um. 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 Um, that one goes to there. Cut that off. That one's straight. That one's straight as well. Yes. Main power restored. Hi guys. Nothing to worry about. Cover me. 
Fuck off. <laughs> Thanks. What the hell are those things? I have no idea. Their attacks seem savage and instinctual, as if they are not sentient species. Sentient enough to hold their attack until we were cornered. Monroe to Enterprise. Go ahead, Lieutenant. We've engaged hostile aliens, sir. Unknown life forms. Team status. Intact. And the Dallas? We've restored partial power. Proceed to the bridge. Find Captain Galloway. Okay. Retrieve Captain's logs on the bridge. Let's go do that. Which is this way. Turbo lift systems offline. We need to reroute <sighs> power to this turbo lift. The computer that governs lift power is right near here. That nearby Jeffrey's tube goes right to it. Okay, Franklin. Yeah. Out my way, Joe. Out the way. Alright. Let's go down. Is this it? Turbo lift access panel. Can I get out of structural integrity mode? Thank you. Right, before I connect that, get that out of there. Connect that. Connect that. Disconnect that. Connect that. And connect that. Yep. Oh. Connect that and that. There you go. Turbo lift power restored. Easy. Turbo lifts are operational again. I like how Chell just, like, nearly followed me. Can can I push him down? No? Okay. Right. Take the turbo lift. To the bridge! <laughs> We're on the bridge deck. I know these Excelsior class ships well. I'll show you the way to the bridge. Okay. Where's, where did Franklin go? Frank! Franklin. Damn. Here they come. What? Poor Franklin. Stay sharp. I don't want to lose anyone else. Ah, <sighs> fucking... Frank, uh, uh, right. Let's just open this weapon energy terminal here. Our oh, objective remains the same, retrieve the captain's log, so that's fine. I mean. Uh. <laughs> right. Hello? Is there any aliens in here? No? Any aliens out here? No. Okay. Right. Drop the force field. And let's con- Fuck off! I don't like you. Yo, Chill's running the assault rifle. Yo, I love the assault rifle. Like, it just looks like a really smart weapon. What's this? Anything in here? No. Open the door. You are a bell end. And you deserve to get exploded. This is the transporter. That's odd. Why would a force field be blocking the transporter room? The aliens don't seem to have the intelligence to do that. Unless someone is controlling them. Right, so there's a force field blocking my access. Right, okay. We still haven't found the bridge. I'm just pointing that out. I guess we didn't have to go this way. I guess we went this we have to go this way. I'm guessing. Nah, cons. What's in here? This is a green light. 
why does this right? Where does this lead me? An observation lounge. I'm guessing I can blast this door. Oh look, we're on the bridge. All right. There's a green light there, but the door's broken, so I'm guessing we can... Yeah, there's a gold starship in here as well, guys. So... Okay, we'll just open the bridge doors for the team. Hi, guys. It's Captain Galloway. Gerard, find out how he died. Chell, access the captain's logs. There are no wounds on him. He died from asphyxiation. Presumably when the Dallas lost life support. The captain's log is online. Play it. Captain's log, stardate 56535.1. We're responding to a distress call from an Atrexian station just outside Federation space. The attack crippled us. I've sent most of my crew to the space station. I hope they can protect the Atrexians. I've kept a small skeleton crew led by my security chief. We're gonna try to salvage the ship by getting it away from the space station. There are too many of them. We've got cascading system failures. We're losing the battle to keep up minimal life support. We can't last more than a few hours. I've authorized my chief engineer to try an experimental procedure. She's encoding our remaining crew into the transporter pattern buffer. It's risky. The signals might degrade beyond recovery. But if it works, it may be the best chance for survival. So that's why the transporter room was blocked. Tells you. Chell, can you disable the green force field blocking the transporter room from here? Done. Gerard, let's head back to the transporter room. Right. Which is... This way. Right. We have to get to the transporter room. Transporter room. Bibbidi bobbidi bibbidi bobbidi bibbidi bob. Open the door. I'm probably going the wrong way. Uh, I did. Fucking tits. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Beep it up, beep it up, beep it up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Open door. Yo, health terminal. And a ding. Their patterns are very weak. They're fading fast. Chell, more power down here. Ooh. They've been in the pattern buffer for a while. <clears throat> They're dehydrated and probably a bit disoriented, but they should be fine. Alex? Mm. You're late, Monroe. I think they're back to normal already. Thanks for the save. I'm Katarina Scott, the chief engineer of the Dallas. This was your plan? My great-grandfather's plan, actually. Captain Montgomery Scott. He developed a procedure for staying alive inside the transporter pattern buffer. Alive with no signal degradation. Very clever. Chell here. I'm trying to get the shields down so we can beam out of here, but the security subsystems are a bit chaotic. I could use some help. Gerard, stay here and treat them until we can get them back to the Enterprise. I'll go assist Chell on the bridge. Monroe, I hear chewing. I need backup. Hurry! On my way, Chell. Right, let's run back and save Chell. But does not lead you to think that. Like, they didn't have any helmets on, shouldn't they? They should have died from asphyxiation when the life support died, just like the captain is on the bridge. So, if that's the case... Ah, fuck. Get out the fucking way, you cunts. But like I say, um, if that's the case, then, like, shouldn't, like... Shouldn't like Telsia and 
Katarina Scott all be dead as well, if that's the case. Hi, child. You safe? I was close. Thanks, Monroe. Gerard to Monroe. The Dallas crew are stable, but we need to get them back to the Enterprise. The Dallas crew should be fucking I dead. The Dallas shields. We can beam out now. Monroe to Enterprise. We're ready to beam out. Understood. Sick bay standing by to receive the Dallas crew members. The card out. Like, I'm sorry, but no. Like, the Dallas life support was offline. Hence why the captain fucking died. He died from asphyxiation, loss of oxygen, life support's dead. What happened? <sighs> we responded to a distress call from an Atrexian space station. Atrexian? A star-faring people with 12 systems and 23 colony planets in the Brecker Rift. We found the Atrexian station under assault by unknown aliens. We saw no alien ship, so we took a low orbit near the station. That was our mistake. They swarmed us, using impulse engines built right into their exoskeletons. Amazing genetic engineering. They disabled our shields and chewed through our hull before we could mount a defense. The ship was doomed. During the firefight, we beamed most of the crew onto the Atrexian station. The captain raced away from the area with a skeleton crew of volunteers. We hid in the pattern buffers to wait for rescue. We hoped our ruined ship could broadcast a warning to Starfleet so no other ship would risk a low orbit at the Atrexian space station. If these aliens had no ship, how did they get to the system? We don't know. Perhaps their ship was cloaked. When we arrive at the station, I want the Hazard team to go in first, locate the remaining crew of the Dallas, and help the Atrexians. Aye, sir. Uh, swear to God. Chelsea Monroe, I'm on the final stage of the shuttle prep. Still, like, the Dallas crew should be dead, I'm sorry, but there's no way of getting around it. There is, n there is just no way of getting around it, I'm sorry, no. Just, just, just no. Anyway, new objective, report of the shuttle bear. That can wait until the next episode. So, I'm cutting it here, thank you, so, thank you guys so very much for watching, if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button, if you liked the video and want to see some more, drop a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next one.